Left-wing political activists and journalists, yeah, not noted for their visual appeal. <coughs> but now science has confirmed what we knew all along. Conservatives are way hotter than liberals. A new study published by Cambridge University Press finds that conservative men and women tend to be physically more attractive than their political opponents. We find that attractive individuals are more likely to identify with the Republican Party and more likely to be conservative, the researchers concluded. So they used huge data sets and all the participants were ranked by other people on their hotness. And conservatives clearly came out on top. This confirms a previous UCLA study which found more feminine, less manly looking women were more likely to be conservatives. Even arch-feminist Lindy West admits that conservative women are prettier. Remember that scene in The Shining where he kisses the hot naked chick who then turns into some kind of zombie witch? Well, scientists have now confirmed that communism has the exact same effect on women. Turns out being a resentful, snarling loser manifests itself physically. <laughs> Why do you think fat social justice warriors are constantly trying to ban offensive Halloween outfits? Sexy, slender women in tight-fitting costumes everywhere. Yeah, it's not rocket science. I'm triggered. Why do you think they tried to ban beach body ads? Same reason. <laughs> the Alberta Youth Communist League. Now, I'm not saying these people are ugly, but when they try to take selfies, their phones spontaneously combust. <laughs> Look at these anti-Milo protesters at UCLA. If they put as much effort into grooming as they do silencing free speech, maybe they wouldn't look like Michael Moore and Rachel Maddow's bastard love child. Just saying. <laughs> look at the girl on the right. Get it? On the right? Hello darkness, my old friend. She's got less armpit hair than Vern Troyer's got head hair. As for the girl on the left, not even a soy boy is gonna wanna touch that spaghetti. Somebody touch my spaghetti! I don't even know what that means. No one knows what it means, but it's provocative. <sighs> no, it's not. It's it gets gross. the people going. Shut up, Hillary girl versus Lena Dunham. Let's just say, I'm with her. <laughs> How to be anti-feminist woman on YouTube, hot, hate of the women, nearly a teenager, unhealthy pathological need for male approval. How to be a feminist woman on YouTube, ugly, hate hot women, hate young hot women, unhealthy need for hair dye. Kill Donald Trump, and then it says kill Mike Pence, and then it says it's guillotine time, bitches. But Paul, I can give you a million examples of liberals who aren't ugly. Yeah, they're celebrities. If they weren't liberals, they wouldn't have a career. I'm talking about activists and journalists. Like this woman. Now, I know they say stand up for your rights, but in this case, mm, probably not a good idea. <laughs> Why do you think the vast majority of the journalists exposed as sex pervs have been lefties? Because they're ugly, they hate themselves, and are therefore very unsuccessful at attracting women in the normal way. I mean, the elephant man gets more right swipes on Tinder than Sam Chris. <laughs> But Paul, stop being such a bigot, people are beautiful at any size. Unless you disagree with their politics, in which case they're an obese tyrant or an emaciated skank. Unless you digitally remove their makeup and then you all have a meltdown. <laughs> now we cross live to CNN for a special report by me. Is radical feminism a refuge for fat, ugly women who can't attract high-value men? The stereotype generally holds true because they look like swamp donkeys. Kind of sad, honestly. Speaking of CNN, everyone's mad at them for promoting cuckoldry, but a study in France found that leftists were more likely to be into it. So CNN's only appealing to its core audience, who in many cases are quite literally cucks. <laughs> So there you have it. It's not my opinion that conservatives are hotter than leftists. It's science. It works, bitches. <laughs> Please click the big red button to subscribe, it really helps me when you do that, and click the bell to allow notifications so you never miss a new video. 